New details tonight at 9 has now been more than a month since 20 year old Damien Myers went missing. His family is beginning to lose hope with each passing day. Our Yam Marisa Say sat down with his family in Clinton, Maryland today to learn how they're trying to stay positive during this difficult time. 20 year old Damien Myers was last seen at this silver diner here in Waldorf. He told his grandfather he was going to get some food with his friends and now more than 30 days later, his family still hasn't heard from him and they're desperate for answers. I'm trying to stay hopeful, but it's hard, you know, I'm trying to stay hopeful, but it's hard. When the hours go by and the days go by, you know what the possibilities are and stuff like that. So all that goes through our heads. The family of Damien Myers has been trying to keep their heads up since Myers went missing on April 14th. We're trying to hold on the best as we can, but it's like, like we need answers. Myers told his grandfather he was going to get food with some friends at a silver diner in Waldorf. When he didn't come home, Richard Myers Sr. became worried. When the phone kept going straight to voicemail, I, you know, I got to thinking then something is not right. First, filing a missing persons report. Now, Prince George's County Police have involved the homicide unit, leaving his family with so many mixed emotions. Rough, hard, tough, unbearable. It don't make me feel good. You know, it went from a missing person, now the homicide unit is involved. Yeah, it's not good. His father's message to every parent right now. I just love when your kids make sure that they're okay. Now, if you have any information regarding Damien Myers' whereabouts, you are encouraged to call Prince George's County Police Department and you can remain anonymous. For now, reporting in Waldorf, Maryland, I'm Yammer Sase, DC News Now.